So it has, was put in, put in Parliament yesterday in the, uh, as a result of the meeting with the Minister on Monday. We will be having further talks today with the Rail Delivery Group. And the suggestion and the idea is that they're going to make a revised proposal. Um, but we'll have to see. You know, I don't know what they're going to tell me when I get in the room. And at some stage, a new written proposal will be put to us. Uh, I don't know whether that will take a long time or whether it will be very quick. But the idea of this meeting is that there will be revised proposals. We've had a, a discussion with Network Rail, which is the other half of the dispute, uh, and that will that will continue. Um, but we. We've been advised that there is a new proposal available. Uh, whether it's mature enough to just be here it is, or we have to talk through a few uh, bits and pieces, we'll see. We'll prove to that what it will be when we, when we read it. And do you have a particular idea of a figure or a number that you're yeah. willing to walk away yeah. from or accept? Well, it's not about pay. Uh, this is a, a three-pronged package. It's about job security, uh, not having compulsory redundancies. It's about the conditions of work and pay is the third part of that element. So we don't go in there to say, that if you give us this number, the dispute will be resolved. It will be a very tight proposal. It will not be generous. It will be way below inflation. And it will have very onerous conditions on it. The three things are intrinsically linked. You can't have one without the other. You can't have a job security package without the conditions. You can't have a pay package without the conditions. Uh, and you will def we will definitely not get a clean pay proposal that just says, Here's the pay. They're not in the position to do that, and they've been instructed directly by the government that they're not allowed to do that. So it will be a very, it will be a big document that we've got to consider, and we'll have to put that to our people, let them see it, and then ask them what they think of it.